guys, it's Adele from Inky Quill and I have a little craft haul for you today. Um, all of these items came from Crafty Pleasures, which is a shop at Bado Bay um, connected to a woman's home, and Ruth, and she is absolutely lovely. If you are on the Central Coast, she has a Facebook page, Crafty Pleasures, and which will also lead to her website. And I think you can also buy online from her as well if you're um, interstate or from around New South Wales. Have a look at Crafty Pleasures. So I got a big haul, like way over budget, way over what I planned buying. But I'm in love with it. So first of all, if you've been watching my videos, you know how desperately I have been looking for these Studio Calico um, star wood veneers and she had them and that's how I found her actually she watched my video and saw that um, I was looking for them and I'm so glad that she did because I am down to my last like 10 stars and dr drastically hoarding them like really bad so I got the stars I got the hearts and arrows and the potty people I haven't had the potty people before so I'm really happy to get that and excuse all the paint on my hands if you can see it I've been painting with kindergarten today and let's just say that's an experience um, so next up I got a couple of roller stamps to add to my collection this is a Shamil one and an Amy Tangerine one both by American Crafts so the Shamil one is a a date stamp and I like that even though it's American it's done in the Australian order of date then month then year I just really like the font and the little hearts too and then this is the Amy Tan one I'm not sure which collection it came with um, it's just called sealed so I'm not sure what that's from but yeah nice and cute Next up, I got some enamel dots, of course. So I got some from Dear Lizzie, um, some from My Mind's Eye. These are just my colours. I couldn't not buy those. Um, and then Kaiser Craft also do these epoxy stickers. So they're a lot thinner. So I'll show you comparison. They are quite thin, um, but they had a lot of different colours available, a lot of different um, shapes. I like this one because of the hearts. These hexagons will be a nice little challenge to use. So they are my new enamel dots. I got a few packets of um, little word stickers, and these are all from my mind's eye, and they're only dollar forty. How good is that? So I haven't had these before. I'm really loving these navy ones. They're probably my favorite. Um, and these are beautiful too. So this one seems to have a lot more um, individual things. Oh no, there we go. I love everything about you. So you can mix and match them. Um, but some of them are together. So the brightest star in the sky is together. So they're really, really cute. Next up, I got some black and white Baker's Twine. It's a nice, thick quality one too, which is nice. And some gold washi tape. Pretty. Ugh, now it's stuck to me. Um, I also got these Kaiser Craft um, Mismatch Collection bingo cards so they've just got different um, little phrases on them you get 10 in the pack they were really cute and I've got some flair so here are she had a box just of miscellaneous flair there were heaps more available too but I have way too many but I couldn't pass these ones up so really cute these are larger and they have a pin on them, which I'll probably just take out or glue, um, put foam tape over the top. I'll see how I go. I thought this one would be great for back to school. And I love the font in those. And as well as those ones, I got these older Dear Lizzie ones. They're really, really cute. 
love this. I'll be yours and you'll be mine. Just perfect colours for me. I got those. And what should we do next? Let's do stamps. I got these two Kaiser Craft stamps, which I love, especially this one. I've been eyeing off the Ali Edwards um, story stamps on her website, but they're just so expensive with postage here to Australia. So I like these ones kind of reminded me of her with the, the circles and the, the cursive font. So I love this one. And this one, look at the, look at those cameras. Look at how cute they are. Really, really sweet and nice little, like a nice little banner. That would look great stamped on cork. A lot of these would actually. The banner, everything, everyday special and unique moments, which is really, really cute. So lots of usable stamps and they are only $7. $7.70. Great, great buy. Uh, I got some thickers. So I got these, which I'm, I'm not sure you've all seen, the white Carl Bateski cursive thickers from Amy Tan. They're really nice. I've got the black ones in these, but I hadn't seen the white before. I got these daiquiri gold thickers, and they're all in a lowercase font, and heaps of numbers. Look at how many numbers you get. That's fantastic. So that's good. I got these Amy Tan other half. Um, they're like a, a mid-range blue, not too dark, not too light. Just right. Let's call them a Goldilocks blue. They're just right. You get lots of numbers in there too. And I've got two packs of these Dear Lizzie. Oh, sorry, Dear Lizzie, what am I talking about? Amy Tangerine uh, scene. And they're a hot pink. And I liked, I got two packs of these because I just really like the font. Um, and I thought I'll go through them quite quickly. I haven't got any, any pink thickers, so thought I might as well get two packets of these and they have upper and lower case but they're still quite small so they'd be perfect for project life um, next up ooh, I got quite a lot from the um, Kaiser Craft Shine Bright the new collection from them now Courtney if you are watching this close your eyes for the next minute because this is for you as a get well soon present don't watch it. Don't watch it. All right, Courtney, I hope you've turned away. So this is the paper pad and it's all yellow, white and black. Beautiful, really modern feel to them. And there's quite a few like this one. You could cut those apart and use them as embellishments. And there's also little bits at the back that you can... Um, that come out that pop out so the Kaiser craft six by six pads are a really good buy I also got the collectibles so there's lots I'm not going to open it because I'll go everywhere but a lot of cursive font stripe chevrons banners nice little pack and the four by six and three by four journaling cards let me just focus that there we go They're really, really sweet and a lot of great filler cards too. Like these ones you could just leave as is if you wanted to. And I also got one of these for me too. Um, Courtney, you can watch again if you're watching. Um, I got these little tiny alpha stickers from Kay's Craft again. I've got the black, the it's like a brownie tan colour and a cream. But I didn't know they came in pink and red. So that was nice. Um, more Kaiser Craft. Ruth is a um, gets a lot of the Kaiser Craft goodies, which is great for me because they're a good price and they're Australian, so there's not a lot of extra cost added to posting them out to Australia. So these two are from the Sea Breeze collection. They're really nice. A lot of blues, florals that is amazing wait until you see the album that i got so really pretty just nice they'd be great for boy layouts um, 
but they'd also be great for girls because you've got these delicate like flowers and spots and florals but you could also pair them with boy things too and I couldn't I've been eyeing this off at spotlight for a while so I got it from her it's the be mine three by four journal cards and it was just so pretty look at that very pretty I got a few paper pads so I got the oh, focus what are you doing there we go I got the shine bright one for me I also got the Sandy Toes, which is a very beach-inspired um, paper pad. So once again, they've got all of the, the borders and pop-outs at the back. Cut-out piece. Really nice beachy, but obviously that's a bit too beachy for me, but I'll use this side and layer it under a photo. But they're beachy without being too in-your-face beachy. I thought that was good and this is the blue bay so it's got I don't know why it's called blue bay when the cards are called sea breeze maybe it's different but it's got a lot of it's got a lot of it's very very similar so um, a lot of blue just drifts woods I'm sure it's the same love that this one's really nice it's um embossed if you can that so it's this one Oop, nice little cut apart they'd be great for embellishments so brilliant for layering next up I got a pack of the um, 6x12 pocket pages uh, Project Life Becky Higgins I can't talk today um, page protectors which I've really been wanting I got a pack of these Kayser Craft Alphas. Now, if you can see, they're just a really nice basic lowercase font, and you get a lot of them. I couldn't resist this pack of the collectibles from the Secret Admirer collection, and it just looks really bright, fun. That floral at the front of the pack just grabbed me and wouldn't let me walk past it. Some really sweet bunting, bird cages. So it's vintagey, but instead of having a lot of vintagey things, sometimes have that dull, like the sepia tones and things like that. This is a really, really bright pack, which works perfect for my style because I love vintage, but I'm not a sepia kind of girl. <laughs> um, next, we've got the Kaiser Craft EXO sticker sheet. So that is a. 12 by 12 sticker sheet. It's got some great borders. These hearts are super versatile. I would love to make a little like bunting out of those on a layer and stitch through them. I think that'd be really cute. And then look at all the words you get. Heaps and heaps of words. So someone, a viewer suggested to use a 12 by 12 sticker sheet in um, an upcoming Grab 5 video. So I might save that one for a Grab 5 coming up. I got a couple of older papers so these are I don't even know who they are mm. some of them are creating keepsakes so these are just you won't be able to get these probably anywhere else some nice stars and a grey polka dot I love this this is the Kaiser Craft blue black blue blah 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 blue bay collection wow I'll say that after a few drinks um, and these are perfect three by four cards so I'll be cutting these up and probably leaving them I love that um, leaving them on my desk to reach that's cute too and then the back is just a stripe which I won't be using I might actually use it for some of oh no I'll probably put those away for later I just don't use the horizontal three by fours very often um, this is the Kaiser Craft Secret Admirer quotes sticker sheet. So this goes with the, the embellishments that I bought really well actually. And it's just got tons of little phrases like, I love you more than yesterday and less than tomorrow. Um, if you live to be 100, then I want to live too. Be a 100 minus one because I never want to live a day without you. Aww. Um, love and you shall be loved. 
love is the closest thing we have to magic. So they're all, top ones are all love, and then they get a bit bigger. And there's just generic, like dream, um, yesterday's history, tomorrow's a mystery, today's a gift, the time to be happy is now. So just really, really sweet phrases. And I got this 12 by 12 um, paper pad. So this was a bit of a splurge, but it was worth it. So these papers are just a whole lot of different textures, which would be great. I love that whitewashed. That's beautiful. Um, a whole lot of textures that would be great for layering behind photos or using as a background. It'd be great for that too. So that's called the base coat 12 by 12 pack. And oh, albums. Okay, I got three albums. I'll save the best till last. First one I got is this Kaiser Craft. Um, does it have a? I don't think it has a style name. No. Oh, confetti. I think. So it's just got this really nice, and it's kind of got, if you can see, it's kind of got like a cross hatch over the top of the flowers, so it looks a little bit like cross stitch. And it's a 12 by 12 D ring album it comes with a few page protectors in it too which is handy so that's the first one next one I got let's zoom out a little bit here we go I was zooming in because my desk is such a mess <laughs> um, next one I got is the American Crafts um, multicolored hearts D-ring album and it's a like a cotton um, cover and you can put a photo inside. I have a Project Life card that has this on it and I really really loved it so I was glad I found that. And then my last one is my favourite and Ruth told me they don't make it anymore so I'm glad I found it. Look at that. Isn't that just beautiful? Oh I love it. Um, so this is, does it have a name? Blue Bay. So this is the Blue Bay D-Ring album and freaking love it. The blue, the turquoise, distressed wood, the doilies, the doors. Oh, it's just so me. So I think this is going to be my 12 by 12 layouts for this year to um, start off with. And then the other ones, last year I had five black and white um, D-Ring albums for my project life. Yep. Five. A little embarrassing to admit that. <laughs> um, so I did black and white last year, and I think this year I'm going to go with floral and bright colours because I've got um, I don't know if it's Shamil or American Crafts or something. I've got a a floral, uh, uh, sorry, a brightly coloured heart album over there, which you can't see, um, and a pink floral one as well. So with those other two, I think that would be perfect. So those. Uh, my goodies from Crafty Pleasures. Um, I'll put a link below to the Facebook and website if you want to check them out. And I'm sure that um, you could buy things anywhere in Australia from them online. All right, thanks for watching, guys, and stay tuned for some upcoming projects using some of these goodies. Bye.